Welcome to today's Bible in the News Report, a feature of your Watchman on the Wall program of Southwest Radio Ministries. I'm Jerry Giltner. I'll be bringing you today's report. You know, I am a terrorist. Well, you may be one too. According to a recently released Department of Homeland Security study, those of us who consider ourselves patriots are, in the eyes of the government, terrorists. Even though we have never taken up arms against the United States government, we have been categorized as being dangerous people. Many of us have served the U.S. in the military, and we love America wanting the best for it. The study was reported by many news sources. Our report is based upon Lee Bellinger's executive bulletin, a supplemental email to Independent Living sent out on July 10, 2012, we quote from a portion of the email, quote, a newly released Department of Homeland Security study entitled Hot Spots of Terrorism and Other Crimes in the United States, 1970 to 2008, characterizes Americans espousing traditionally patriotic values as potential terrorists. Yes, that's right. It's all in the report on pages 11 and 12 where it purports law-abiding Americans exhibiting any of these characteristics to be potential extremists and right-wing terrorists. Americans who are fiercely nationalistic as opposed to universal and international in orientation. Americans considering themselves anti-global. Americans who are suspicious of centralized federal authority. Americans who are reverent of individual liberty, especially their right to own guns and be free of taxes. Americans exhibiting a belief in conspiracy theories that involve grave threat to national sovereignty and or personal liberty, and a belief that one's personal and or national way of life is under attack. How far we've come. Do these characteristics sound familiar? They should to anyone who just celebrated the 236th anniversary of the founding of our country. During the drafting of the Constitution, John Adams, Benjamin Franklin, Thomas Jefferson, James Madison, and George Washington all expressed strong suspicion of centralized authority, reverence for individual liberty, and beliefs that were persistent grave threats to national sovereignty and or personal liberty. Close quotes. If those men were alive today, they would be considered potential terrorists. I say we're in pretty good company. Here's how far we've come. The Bible says, And they have rewarded me evil for good and hatred for my love. That's from Psalm 109, verse 5. Well, that pretty much sums up the DHS study regarding patriotic Americans. And that's today's Bible in the News Report, a presentation of Southwest Radio Ministries. These reports are published each month in a booklet. You can get a complimentary copy by calling, writing, or visiting our website. The number to call is 1-800-652-1144. Write to Southwest Radio Ministries, Post Office Box 100, Bethany, Oklahoma, the zip code is 73008. The website address is swrc.com. Join us for the next Your Watchman on the Wall program when once again we include a Bible in the News report.